Hero Black Cadillac High Heel Brain Tennis Everybody gonna die So baby's bad, oh baby's gonna die Doctor Heather ain't no coming back Wanna take a run at that I think she's feeling me Turn it up a few degrees My imagination of her body gets the best of me Oh God, she's such a tease Bitten lips, bruised knees I'm addicted to her, need her touching me Cause she got a bad little waist And I'm tearing down this place Stop the liquor that we chase Got some needles to the face Baby, I don't need no space Coming closer for a taste And I'll show you how I make Everything just fade away Cause she's a like here. Hello? Huh? Huh? Stop. Huh. 
Hello. Are you okay, mister? No, it was nothing. It was just a sudden fall. Must have been hard then, right? Obviously. So, what is your problem anyways? Well, I would like to get my sheep across the train tracks. Hmm, it must be a challenge then. So, by the way, what are you guys here for anyways? Track maintenance and replacements and stuff? Sounds like a hard duty then. Can some of you guys help me get most of my sheep across the train tracks then? Yes, sir. We could try to do anything as we can as soon as possible. Alright, we have a deal then. Hey, that tickles. Sorry. Hold up, I'm gonna tell one of my other workers to help me change out the switch on the siding you're standing next to, while the other two will provide protection on the other end. Alright then. Hey, one of you other guys, take over the motor car while we switch out the points to help this fellow over here. And don't forget to drive the motor car by reversing it at the other end of the siding, in order to provide flag protection for the shepherd to get his entire herd across these lines. This will ensure to warn any oncoming trains to slow down at this siding. So you fools better listen, or else we're not gonna get paid. Alright, I'm coming. Ha. Ah. Ah. Ha! I got you this time! And I didn't take any damage! Can we just move on and just put the jokes aside and just get to it then? Yes. Now, just wait for our instructions while we head over to the sightings we're assigned to. This is my other friend that works with me. However, he struggles to speak English a bit, but I know a little of his villager language. By the ways, what is your name? Shepherd Steve. By the ways, my name is villager number two, and his name is villager number one. Strange. Why do you guys don't have names? I don't know. Maybe that's just what we're named. Whatever. Just do your job. Hmm? Okie dokie. You know when it comes to working on the railroad, I know this song. I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. Huh, you seem to not understand that then. Well, go ahead and switch it. Hey, villager number one, do you want to hear a strange joke? I'm you. Hmm, I guess you just didn't understand that one then. Um, you guys? I think I hear something that is approaching you, and I think it's a train. Darn, they can't hear me. Holy smokes! Switch it back now! Come on, lad! Don't you at least speak English? Let me do it! Run! Oh no! I didn't switch it back enough in time, and we're in really big trouble! The boss isn't going to be pleased about this, and we may lose our jobs because of what I did. Looks like my payday isn't coming anytime soon because of this mess.